Tonight, we're getting a detailed look at what another budget cut will mean for our universities and how many classes will be chopped to make up for it. What would we have to do if we were to furlough our employees at LSU to meet this budget reduction? Well, this budget reduction is so large, we'd have to furlough everybody for the entire year. The 2016 executive budget proposes huge cuts to higher education in Louisiana. LSU President and Chancellor Dr. F. King Alexander spoke to the Baton Rouge Press Club today about the changes LSU will have to make to make ends meet. NBC 33's Tim Sproles has the story. It's safe to say that Dr. F. King Alexander is not amused by the 2016 executive budget. So if nothing else happens but this budget gets passed as is, without the tax credits changes, without a lot of the things that our legislative leadership has shown a great interest in trying to tackle and address, we're looking at about an 82 percent budget reduction. That is in statewide reductions. But how would these budget cuts specifically affect LSU? Because we're only 13 percent funded from the state of Louisiana. If this cut goes unmitigated and goes unaddressed in our legislative session, it will be funded by 2.9 percent coming from the state. Dr. Alexander says he has no idea what lawmakers are going to do. Cuts of that size do not leave a lot of wiggle room to make changes. Raising tuition is a far-fetched option because two-thirds of the state legislature have to sign off before that's allowed. So that leaves LSU looking into its own cuts. Dr. Alexander thinks that this could be crippling. You will have 2,000 less classes next year to choose from. That means your retention rate slows down, your graduation rate slows down. You may not even have any courses to sign up for. He has faith that our lawmakers will make some positive changes to the budget during the upcoming session. But he's still concerned. But if you're a parent and you're sitting at orientation at a college visitation and the president gets up and says you ought to come to our university because we'll spend less on your son or daughter than anybody else in the United States. <laughs> How far is that going to go? In Baton Rouge, Tim Sproles, NBC 33 News. Dr. Alexander is encouraging LSU students and parents to contact their legislatures to share their thoughts on the budget cuts.